Okay. Here's another thing to know if you if you come in by this trail. Yeah. All you gotta remember is this tree right here. Oh, okay. See how it, it bends over? Yeah. You say, whoa, I just cut down there and there's a swing set. And there's the swing set. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so that's a good point. Okay, here's the big slough canal. If you peek down in here, see this? This here's the big, this is where there's gators and all kinds of cool stuff down in here. Okay, now this in relation to the swing, to the foot swing, that's why I tie all this together. Now this little primitive trail we're on, this is actually the, uh, this would be the, the original live long trail. This is the primitive version. That wide path we come up, that is like an access road slash live long trail. It's just people kind of use it. I think it's easier for older people or maybe somebody is just an easy way to get up here but anyway that was interesting he pointed out this bent tree so right here at the bent tree on this primitive trail we're going to turn right and we're facing power line we're pa facing back to the park we turn right and then we walk right back in here and you can kind of see the snaky looking trees well, probably 50 yards. yeah i would say it's about 50 yards about 50 yards over here maybe not quite but we'll just walk and you can get time and distance by just watching the video yeah it's probably 50 yards yeah I think about the, trying to heave a football it would it would land out in here from so the canals right back there and the swing is right up here. We'll walk to the swing if I can find it. Like I said, this Florida terrain is just crazy. It's You get in here and just everything looks the same. And it's real easy to lose your bearings. Okay, this is the little field behind the swing. And then right there is the big sprawling tree that has the swing. So that's in reference to the big slough canal. And then once again, the crime scene is directly that, that direction over to Live Long's access trail. And that's where the crime scene circles and all that stuff we had looked at previously. So I'm gonna shut down now and we're gonna go over and see if we can find that fourth circle.